Hi YouTube. Um, it's me, and my first video on this channel is going to be a nail collection video. And I haven't had time to make any videos because I've been really busy, but I'm on vacation for this whole entire week, so I can make videos. Um, if you hear anything in the background, that's because I'm watching Bridezilla. Bridezilla's. And it's about to get ugly. And hold on, I have to let my dog out. Sorry. So I have all of my nail fit, all of my um, nail polishes written down here so that I don't have to keep looking on the bottle, and um, I'll get started. This is just a collection. Now, first, I have, um, I have mostly NYC, New York color, um, nail polishes. But that's because I like them, because they dry quickly, and you don't have to put a ton of coats on to get the color that you want. So the first one, and they're cheap. They're 99 cents. So the first one I have is called French White Tip, and it's a white for French manicures. The white kind of makes it whiter than it is. Then the next one I have is called Skin Tight Denim, and it's a navy blue, metallic navy blue. Very metallic -y. Then the third one I have is Broadway Burgundy, and it's uh, red. Here we go. My fourth one is um, called Cashmere Cream, and it's a really light sort of sky blue. Hold on, then, guys. I have to go let her back in. Okay. Never mind. Um, my fifth one is, it doesn't have a specific name, but it's just a really bright orange. There you go. Then my my sixth one is called Big Money, and it's um, a frost, and it's just a green. I'm trying to get it to hit the light so you can see the metallic part. There you go. It's a green. Hold on, I have to go let my dog back in. Percy! Okay. Then my seventh nail polish is um a uh, um a hot pink. My fourth one is called, well, let me check these off so I know where I am. And did I say fourth? My eighth one, sorry. My eighth one is called Deep Current, and it's also a frost. And it's a really nice purple. Then I have this nail, um, New York color nail gloss, and it doesn't really have a specific color, but it has this cap on it, and you take that off, and then there's the, um, and then there's the brush, but it's basically just, um, a metallic pink sort of color. Then my um, next, my last New York color nail polish is polyester pink, 
and it's just a really light pink. You can't really. There you go. It's just a really light pink. Sorry, my dog and my cat are playing. Gracie, stop. Okay. Um. Then I have one OPI nail polish because they're kind of expensive. These are seven fifty each where I live. And this one is in Aphrodite's Pink Nighty. And it's just a really light pink. I had this on my fingernails, but I had to take it off. Because it was chipping, because I forgot to put a top coat on. But it's a very nice pink. Then, um, my next two are finger paints. And I have this one, and it's called Strike a Pose Rose. And these are a pretty good price. And it's just a pinkish red sort of color. Then my last finger paint um, nail polish is called Add an, Abst Add an Abstract. And it's a blue. Then I have a body shop nail polish um because my mom used to sell things for them so it was easy to get a hold of things um and this is in rose petal red and it is a deep burgundy wine red sort of color I'm trying to get it to hit the light so you, there you go that's the real color and I really like that one. Then I have an Express Finish in Pink Sorbet. And it's just a light pink, kind of like the polyester pink from NYC. It's just a light pink. Then, um, where to go? Wait. And then I have a Sally Hansen Hard as Nails in White Whip. And this is just a white for French manicures, also. And that's it for the ones that have names. And then these are kind of just miscellaneous ones that aren't a particular color. I have a Claire's nail polish in a really hot pink. I usually use this on my sister because it dries like that. It dries so quickly. And my sister's three and she can't sit long enough for her nails to dry. So I usually put this on her because it dries so quick. Then I have a limited two nail polish in sort of a spring green sort of color. In a spring green color. And it's got glitters in it, but you have to put a thousand coats of this on. Number one, the brush is kind of funky. It's like wide. And then you have to put a thousand coats on. Or not a thousand, I'm exaggerating, but you have to put a lot of coats on in order for it to for the color to come out. And I'm already on eight minutes, so I should probably hurry. Then I have a Delia's nail polish in a really bright electric green, which I wore on St. Patrick's Day. Then I have a um, Bite No More from Super Nail, and it's just this stuff that you put on your nails to stop you from biting it, and when you do bite your nails, it tastes really disgusting, and it's just clear. It tastes really nasty, and it worked because it got me to stop biting my nails. Then the rest are kind of um, just top and base coats. I have an OPI Natural Nail Base Coat. I have a finger paints base coat, and I have a finger paints top coat. Then I want to just quickly talk to you about a foot refreshing spray from the body shop that I think works fabulous. Um, it's with um, it's a refreshing foot spray with rosemary and tea tree oils to help deodorize the feet. Um, and it's from the body shop, and this is just a little baby size because I love anything baby. So this is just a little baby size, but I do actually have the actual size. And it works really nice. You just spray it on your feet and it kind of leaves them fresh feeling and it deodorizes them. And it kind of smells like mint. 
But that's it because I'm running out of time. So please comment, rate, and subscribe, and I'll have more videos up later. Bye, guys.